Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. So today we are diving headfirst into the exciting world of Midjourney V6. You know the latest and the most powerful iteration of this groundbreaking AI tool which is Midjourney. So you know, buckle up because we're about to uncover its hidden depths and unleash your inner creative genius. All right, so first of all, if I told you guys like how you can set up the new latest version of Midjourney v6.0 into your uh, Midjourney. So obviously, first of all, you need to integrate Midjourney with Discord. And when you open that Discord, you need to click on the Midjourney button right over here. And this will basically direct you to all the options that you can get in Midjourney. So you can basically come into any of the newcomer rooms and for activating your uh, the new version 6.0, you need to hit backslash and settings all right which is right over here and into hit enter right so this will basically you know give you all the options in the settings that you can get in the mid journey boss so over here you can see we have the option of mid journey model v6 alpha so this is basically you know the alpha uh, version so uh we'll test this out like how good it is so if you can click on that so you can go ahead and access the new mid journey model v6 alpha quickly all right so uh if you guys were wondering like what's new in uh you know the latest update of mid journey v6 so v6 isn't just a paint brush upgrade because it's a complete overhaul so you know we're talking enhanced aesthetics sharper details and deeper understanding of your commands and you know what? that's not at all because here are some key features to get your brain buzzing while using mid journey v6 Okay, so first up, we have command evolution. So, you know, new commands like very subtle and very strong open up a whole new realm of fine tuning. So, let me show you guys. All right, so if I jump into uh, my mid journey, so, you know, make sure your mid journey is subscribed. So, after that, you can go ahead and jump into any of these newcomer rooms. So, let's just say I go ahead and go over here. And, you know, you just need to like hit backslash, imagine, and it will basically give you the option of prompt. So, let's just say I hit my prompt here that a very subtle painting of a woman sitting on a park bench reading a book the color should be muted and soft and the overall mood should be peaceful and serene okay all right so first of all you know let's just go ahead and try this without the v6 okay with like the without the latest upgrades so we'll basically uh see the comparison like how uh the v6 version like the new upgrade and like the other one which was a normal uh mid during the old version like how do they differ from each other okay so we're gonna see that okay so first of all let's just go ahead and see the simple version of this prompt that we are checking off command evolution all right so as you guys can see like you know our image has been generated so you know for the prompt a very subtle painting of woman sitting on a park when reaching a book so if you can go ahead and open this so you can see you no know, these images not look that great because uh you know like it's very much you can say animated and they are not like fine details uh, to this image right so now let me show you a magic. If I can go ahead and copy this prompt and you know, just go to over here and let me, let me just put in my prompt again. And after that, if I give the space and give two dashes and then I say V space six. Okay, so this will basically integrate the new V6 version of mid journey into your prompt. And I'll see like, you know, how much big of a difference is going to make to our image, okay? All right, so as you guys can see, it's basically clearly showing, you know, that the version 6.0 has been active. So let's just go ahead and wait for that. All right, guys, so take a look at that. How good this all looks because, you know, our prompt was, you know, the color should be muted and soft. The overall mode should be peaceful and serene. So it was basically, you know, kind of a painting. So now if you look at this, so this looks very, very like engaging and promising because it looks like, you know, it's been painted. So as you guys can see, we can see the details of color, like the painted colors in that. And check this out. You know, it clearly like seems like it is generated from painting or something. So if you can go ahead and compare to the normal one that we just did before. So that was this. Okay, so this is not like painting. So it's clearly you can see it seems like it has been like generated from AI or something. But you know, now with the help of our uh, new version 6.0 of mid journey you can basically go ahead and you know evaluate all uh, your images with the command that you're going to input all right all right so the next feature that we're going to talk about is text magic so you know you can seamlessly integrate text into your creations now like from titles to code with precise positioning and style control okay so let me show you guys that all right so if you jump into our mid journey so as you guys can see right over here is saying you know minor text drawing ability you must write your text in quotation and style raw or lower stylized uh, you know values may help so you know now basically you can create a text in your images so this is the new update in uh, the mid journey 6.0 so 
let's just go ahead and you know create imagine prompt once again and in that let's just say i want to write like a photo of the text hello world written with a marker on a sticky note so if i can go ahead and click that so take a look at that you know so this is a photo of the text hello world written with a marker on a sticky note so as you guys can see right over here this is working absolutely perfect you know and just uh, one of the variation, you know, it messed up the writing. But other than that, because as you know, this is a beta version, but it will uh, improve, you know, in the future. But, you know, the rest are looking absolutely perfect. So if I can go ahead and upscale on my fourth image, so this is going to look like this. And, you know, and now you can use basically uh, these type of images. You can create these images by using the prompt. But remember uh, to write the text that you want that to be written in the double apostrophe commas, okay? All right, so the next feature is the upscaling power. So now you can basically breathe life into your existing images with creative upscaling, you know? You can basically uh, boost resolution and add intricate details to your images as well. So let's test this out. All right, so if you jump into our mid journey again, so as you guys can see right over here, it's showing uh, in the announcement as well. So you can improve upscalers with both subtle and creative mode. So if I can go ahead and, you know, uh, like select an image and upscale that. So after that, you get more options to upscale, which are subtle and creative. So these are options that are being added in the new mid journey version 6.0 so if you can go ahead and click on subtle so take a look at that so it has basically you know almost double the resolution of the image that it was before so it is now very very clear so you know like check out the detail to this image so now you know you can basically enhance the upscaling like it was never uh with the help of this amazing mid journey version 6.0 all right all right, so the next feature uh, we have is Grammar Guru. So V6 basically understand the nuisances of language. So, you know, your prompts become even more powerful and expressive. So let me show you that. So if I can go ahead and jump to my mid journey and let's just say go for the imagine into the prompt, which is a painting of a woman who is both beautiful and strong with fierce eyes and a determined expression, but also a kind smile and a gentle touch. After that, if I go ahead and hit space dash dash, we dash six. So, you know, as soon as we put enter. So this will basically identify like either the woman will be like beautiful and strong. It will basically, you know, identify all the grammar into this prompt and generate the image for me according to the grammar that I input. Okay, so let me show you that in a minute. All right, so check this out. This is amazing. You know, we basically understood our prompt and generated image of a woman who is both beautiful and strong with fierce eyes. And, uh, you know, determine expression, but also a kind smile and a gentle text. So take a look at that. You know, this is exactly, it basically understood the grammar and the prompt they want to generate. And, you know, now if you mess up the words, mess up the grammar, so with the help of the new version 6.0, it will understand the prompt for you and generate the image with literally no problem at all. All right, so the last feature that we're going to talk about is Framtastic. So, you know, you can basically now add custom frames and borders to your masterpieces, you know, from vintage wood to futuristic and neon as well so let me show you that as well so if i jump into my uh, mid journey again with the same imagine prompt and the prompt that i'm going to input is a futuristic digital painting of a cityscape framed in a neon colored frame that pulses and glows with light so again i'm going to input like dash dash we as six and if i can go ahead and you know enter that all right so now it can basically you know generate borders for us as well in the images so you know it is a very very cool update if you ask me so our prom was a futuristic digital painting of a cityscape framed in a neon colored frame that pulses and glows with light so if i can go ahead and open this so i think i'm really much liking the second one, you know, it's really, really cool. So if I, I can go ahead and upscale the second one. All right, so check this out. You know, it is all done with our neon border uh, at the cityscape in the middle, all right? All right, guys, and there you have it. Thanks for joining me on this deep dive into the latest update of Mid Journey V6. So yeah, I hope you liked this video. And I'll see you in some other one. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.